Lack of focus, lack of purpose, lack of discipline is all it takes for you to live a half-assed life. But it don't have to be that way. In this video, I'm gonna show you the basics of monk mode. I'm gonna show you the benefits of monk mode. And I'm gonna show you how to actually do a monk mode to where you get real life results. Now y'all know I ain't no Xbox. We ain't playing no games. So we are gonna get right into it. What is monk mode? Monk mode is what I like to call total immersion. That's right, full on get after it. It's putting aside all your distractions, everything that gets in your way so that you can focus specifically on a goal for a certain amount of time yes that means all distraction and i'm talking no social media no unhealthy eating habits no toxic relationships yeah i'm talking to some of y'all out there that means no fapping no sex let me say that one more time no sex that also means no overindulgence in entertainment i'm talking tv youtube for a lot of y'all to be on there for hours no netflix no more netflix specials no more netflix series no more binging all that all of that stuff has to go to the wayside so you can focus all on your goal you don't get it near Nearly every single bit of your free time needs to be focused on your self-improvement and that's it. Now why should you do monk mode? Now if you're feeling down bad, if you're feeling stagnant, you feeling like you hit a plateau, you feeling like your mental health is bad, you feeling like your actual health is bad, you feeling like your physique is not where it wants to be, you feeling like your money isn't right, those are all reasons that you should do monk mode. I'm being serious with it. Those are all reasons you should do monk mode and here's the truth. Monk mode really can change your life. Trust me. If you're in a situation right now in life, monk mode will be the best thing that will help you turn that process around real quick. And now guys, I don't want you to get confused. Monk mode is not some magical genie that you can just rub the rub the lamp and make all your magical wishes come true. It don't work like that. Monk mode is work. As a matter of fact, it's hard work and it's gonna take pretty much everything that you have. But let me tell you something, if you do it and if you do it correctly, the results will be crazy. Now let's talk about the benefits you get in monk mode. You're gonna gain self-awareness and trust me, you're gonna get a whole lot of it because you ain't gonna have all the distractions that you used to. You're gonna be forced to sit there with just your own thoughts, but that's okay because I believe self-awareness is the building block for self-improvement. Because I always say this, if you don't know about it, then you can't change it. Improve focus and productivity. Let's be real. Both of these areas of your life are going to skyrocket and that's just a byproduct of what happens when you eliminate distractions and focus everything on one singular point. You will get a mental health boost. You're gonna get a mental health boost because sometimes in life doing less actually does more for your mental mental health than you could ever imagine. You're gonna be able to stabilize and control your emotions and this is gonna give you a lot of clarity onto how you think and feel. Throw a little meditation on top of that and then you're gonna be able to control how you think and feel. It's a big time game changer. Improve health and well-being. One of the main benefits of going monk mode is this going to improve your health and that's because you're going to be focusing on diet. And yes, we talked about it a little bit earlier. Yes, it's gonna help you get a great physique, but mainly what we're gonna be focusing on is going on a diet and eating the foods that are gonna help us perform at the very best we can every single day. Your habits will improve. Not only are you going to become aware of your bad habits and systematically start to remove them, you're going to have time to implement new and constructive habits which are going to take you to where you want to be, aka take you to your goal. Monk mode will reduce stress. Let's face it, in 2022, our attention is everywhere. We are scattered in a thousand different places. We are trying to be a thousand different people at once. And again, to reduce stress, you can actually do that by doing less instead of more. Bars. <laughs> Now we're gonna talk about how to actually do monk mode. The first thing that you need to do is figure out your goals. And guys, I've said it before and I will keep saying it. You cannot go anywhere if you don't know where you want to go. <laughs> you cannot go in the direction of life if you have no idea what you want. That's just what it is. I believe knowing your goals and knowing what you want to do is a key fundamental building block of self-improvement. You need to figure out how long you're going to do monk mode. Look, being real, doing monk mode in any kind of capacity is going to help you in your life, whether that's one day or seven days. But if I'm being a hundred with y'all, I recommend that beginners do 30 days. And I recommend that people that really need a life change, that really need something to happen in their life, you go straight forward, you dive head first and you go 90 days. Next, you need to list out all your distractions. Take a little time to reflect. Then I want you to list out everything that's a problem in your life. And then I want you to write another list and I want you to list out everything that is distracting you from your goal. It's that simple. Cut out all distractions. It's just like I just said. Take that list that we just drew up and eliminate all those distractions. Next is focus on your goals exclusively. And now, finally, thanks to all the time you have from eliminating all those distractions, it's time to focus on that goal. It's time to get to work. And I'm not playing, I'm not just talking about little work. I'm talking about really putting in that work. 
like really getting after it. It's time, it's your time, let's get it. Now, if you want more in-depth details about Monk Mode, I have a whole playlist that details the ins and outs and everything you need to know about going Monk Mode. I suggest y'all check that out. Peace.